Every morning, like clockwork, our dog Champ comes down, goes to the bathroom at 6 a.m. and comes right back in and right back to bed. Every morning, same time, like clockwork. If you ever get sick of just seeing the same old video over and over again of me driving down the road, uh, just tell me. Unbelievable. Drive all the way to work and left my wallet at home. And now I have to drive back and get it and get back to work in time. I've got, I've got uh, 37 minutes. So that should be enough time. The deal is I have to, as soon as the radio show is over, I have to jump in the car and drive an hour to Starkville for a dinner meeting. So I really did not need this to happen. So, back to the office. You know, I'm so fortunate and blessed. To have this been is the part the where we the head coach at, are at doing a radio show, and, you know, replaying job, things like that we've already done today. And uh, just it's uh, the, excited it's the hardest part of what we do. To keep this the focus is on the difficult. <laughs> Matt, what's that dynamic going to be like? That's my voice. Between you and Coach Longo, like almost just from a mode of operandum. When it's a radio show over, now headed down the road to Starkville, home of Mississippi State University, my alma mater, and have a dinner tonight with some folks on the football radio broadcast crew that I'm a part of. We have a new play-by-play. -play announcer named Neil Price comes over from University of Kentucky. We have a new sideline reporter named Jay Perry. And I've known Jay a little longer and he's just, you know, he's local. I've known Neil for a little while but I've only gotten to spend just a tad bit of time around him so I'm looking forward to getting to hang out with him tonight. And also some folks from Learfield Communications. They're based out of Jefferson City, Missouri. But they are the media rights holder for Mississippi State University, so they are who employs us to broadcast these games. So we're all, uh, they had some meetings today. I couldn't go because of my radio show. Get to get down here. We're having dinner at a place I really like. It's called The Veranda. Really good food. I haven't been in a while. And so we'll see uh, what's on the menu. Hopefully the crispy duck. If the crispy duck is on the menu, then that's what I'll be getting. So I'm going to have to leave this camera in the car and hope that it doesn't get stolen and I'll try to shoot inside with my phone. That's good looking food right yes, there. Indeed. You want to try to take a picture of it? Well, no, I'm just a little video. Oh, I see okay. my duck over there. I'm just waiting. Yes, indeed. Chicken parmesan. Yeah, right. yeah. Chicken. Oh, I'm videoing mine. Crispy duck. Quack. Quack. <laughs> I don't even know what that other stuff is. I don't need to know. I'm just eat it. Was a great meal. Whee! There we go. That was a great meal. The crispy duck was awesome. Back home.